it's just after 7 a.m. Um, didn't have much success with the saltwater fishing here in Florida. It was actually terrible, so I want to try to something a little bit easier, supposedly. Some freshwater fishing. Um, this has, I looked on Google Maps and I saw a pond pretty close by to where we stayed. So we're going to check it out to see if, it's, if it has fish, if we could fish there. Let's see if I can catch anything. We'll see how it goes. Misty. Just after 7 a.m. Just got bright. We're trying. If I get something, you'll see it. If not, you ain't seen all this. See what can happen. Hopefully, we get a large mouth bass. So, we'll say no trespassing private property. Residents fishing only. Pond looks very good. Really good place to fish, guys. Must have some large bone bass in here. Hopefully nobody chases me away. Just gonna put that down right there. Make some casts. Very, very cold. See that fish already on top of the water here. Yeah. I wanna spin a bit, I grab to you. See if we can make something happen guys. I think there's carp in here. Yeah, that's a big carp right there. There's a fish guys, there's a fish. Small fish. Oh, he fell off. Damn it. So there are bass in here, it is very small. At least I hooked something. That one was the smallest one. There are a couple of residents watching me right now guys. Not sure how long I should be fishing here again for, but at least I know there's fishing here. There's a fish guys, small bass, I'll flip them up, just to say I caught one. Nice little micro bass, about 13 to 14 inches. So I caught one, oh, big fish this one. We're going for the release. Alright guys, so we could call it a successful pond mission in the neighborhood. Micro bass, maybe 13 inches, but still a fish. I think the problem with hooking these bass is this rod, four piece travel rod. Doesn't have the backbone to pierce that hook through their mouth. They're pretty tough fish. So not getting the best hook sets on them. Still, able to catch one. Hi guys, so we went to the neighborhood pond, we got two bites and I bought fish about half an hour. Caught one bass, one spit out. Small guys, 13, 14 inches, but still, I think my new favorite thing is bass fishing because it's so easy. <laughs> Spin a bit work, catch a nice little one, throw him back. So if I see an next pond anyway, I'll try it again, but today's the last day. 
Let's see how it goes. Hi guys, just returning to the spot I came this morning. I caught the one little bass. Just because I have bass fever right now. It's neighborhood spot, houses around. It's going duck through right here. I'm a private property, you know, residence fishing only. So let's see what can happen. Okay guys, last five minutes here trying to get a bite with these bass. Put on a top water popper. It's supposed to work. What five gas? Holy crap, that was a surprise boy, first throw the papa. Miss it though. You see the trick boy, chicken boy? Change our bait boy. Damn, that was a real surprise. Normally, bass stick in the same area. Fish on! Bass on, bass on! Yeah! Got one on the popper, man! <laughs> calm down, buddy. Hey, 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 calm down, buddy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Alright, nice guys. Hope you can see this in the kind of dark. We switched to the popper. This little bass crushed it. Going for the release. Hope the GoPro is on. It is. So, gentle release. <gasps> yes! Alright, guys, successful mission, so to speak. Catch one bass on the popper. Never catch a bass on a popper. So, it was pretty cool. Maybe we might take a bike ride in the morning if I don't kill myself, but. Other than that, that was bass fishing in Florida. Could be done, nothing too big. Maybe up to 10, 14 inches, but still a lot of fun on bubbles. Again, it could be carp, because you have big, big carp inside here. Carp do not take line. Well, let's see if I should bread. Oh, that was a bass. Damn it. How was that bass? Okay guys, so my time is quickly winding down. Did get about two or three blobs on the puffer. One was a good take. I have about maybe 10 minutes again to fish, so I'll make about three more casts with the puffer and I'll put on a different bait. Not sure what bait I go on for one, but let's try something different. The last 10 minutes. Bass fishing guys. A little bit addictive. Top water. I guess any fishing on top water is hard to take off this popper, but just to catch a fish, I might have to change it up. A couple more casts with this.
think they have some really small bass in here so a couple of the hits and the pop out the bass will probably micros There's a fish. Nice bass. Nice little guy. So the top water bite is the best. Small guys. But he crushed this bait. There we go guys, a Florida large mode bass. Top water. Can't beat it. Small guy again, but super aggressive and on the top water. There you go, buddy. Hi, guys. I was about to change the top water. It is 5 to 8, so I'm supposed to leave here at 8. Wild dog through this top water for 5 more minutes until 8 o'clock. Hi, guys. So that does it for bass fishing in Florida. It was a lot of fun. I'm using my four piece travel rod. And well, this popper was the most fun. Fishing bass on top water is a lot of fun. Small fish, but very aggressive. Never caught a bass before this trip. Caught about three or four. I hope to do it again soon. Hope you guys enjoyed watching. It was fun just coming through the neighborhood, looking at the ponds, looking for fish. I hope to do it again soon. Thanks for watching, guys. Till the next video, keep fishing. Fish on.